Hey guys, welcome to my next Let's Play. In here today we're doing another Capcom game. This time, Mega Man X for the Super Nintendo. <coughs> so let's go ahead and get right into it. In this game, you start out in an intro stage. You don't get a pick from the eight right away. The eight bosses. <coughs> so this game, I feel is uh, one of the best on the Super Nintendo. Um, just everything about it, gameplay, um, graphics, music, especially the music. The music of this game is superb, I think. It's just, it's just awesome. Especially the Storm Eagle theme, which we'll, you'll hear later on. Um, this game, though, um, the basic story is it takes place a hundred years after the classic series. So, Mega Man, Roll, uh, Rush, Base Trouble, people like that are long dead and gone. Um, some some old characters will return in one way or another, which you'll see. Um, as far as gameplay goes, this game changed a few things. From the classic series, um, like wall jumping, which you saw me do a second ago. Um, instead of sliding, you will dash, but you need an upgrade to do that, which is kind of the newer thing for the series as well. And in my personal opinion, I prefer the X series over the classic series. Um, I'd say the only problem with this game is that it is too easy. I feel like Possibly is it even easier than Mega Man 2, uh, the North American version, and the normal difficulty, which is pr pretty damn easy. <clears throat> but I mean, that's not to say that this is not a good game, because this game is fantastic. So, just because it's easy does not mean anything. But as far as music go, I think this game, to me, it settles like a big debate that goes on what's better, Sega Genesis or Super Nintendo, and they're both great 16-bit systems. But I feel like Super Nintendo just always can produce higher quality sound. Here's our first boss, Vile. And you cannot beat this guy, you just gotta let him will on you. But I feel like if you want to hear something similar, like music-wise, it would be like uh, the Ninja Turtles games for both systems. The Super Nintendo one's just higher quality. They have a lot of the same tracks. You worthless piece of scrap metal. Did you think you could defeat me? And now our good buddy Zero is going to save our ass. And Jetson. And he has a badass theme song too. Like I said, every track in this game is amazing. I guess I'm not powerful enough to defeat him. X, you shouldn't expect to defeat him. He is designed to be a war machine. Remember, you have not reached full power yet. If you use all the abilities you were designed with, you should become stronger. You may even become as powerful as I am. Yeah, Zero's kind of a cocky dick. I'll scout ahead and collect as much information on Sigma's fortress as I can. I'll meet up with you when you get there. See you later. X, I know you can do it. Uh, passwords, because this game does not have a battery safe. So here's our Mavericks. Um, unlike the classic games, they're not robot masters. They're not human oids. They're based off of different animals. So we're going to start here. And we are going to go after Chill Penguin, who's by far the easiest Maverick in the game. So... 
X and Zero have a pretty pretty interesting relationship that definitely gets better explained uh, in later games. We'll see. And um, unfortunately, Zero is not playable in this game. He will become playable. Damn, he'll become playable in uh, other games in the series and go on to have his own series as well, which is pretty badass. But I don't like it as much as as this one. But still, pretty pretty solid series. You know what I mean? Like this is just it's just a little bit too easy. I mean I know this is this is like the easiest Maverick stage and maybe it's because I played this game so many times over the years. I mean, not a year has gone by since I've owned this game that I have not played and beat it. It's just one of those games that never gets old. Even when you know everything coming up, it's just it does not get old. So, another new thing with this game series does have the classic one is these upgrades which are capsules and dr light shows up so you've come x i give you the ability to choose your own path in life and i hope that the world would allow you to choose a peaceful one but now it seems that you are destined to fight because i thought the world might need a new champion i have hidden capsules like this one if you find and use them, you will be able to increase your powers beyond anything the world has ever known. Step into this capsule and receive an acceleration system to boost your speed. Good luck, X. So this is going to let us dash, which you dash in these games instead of sliding. And in two, Mega Man 2, X2 and on, yeah, you don't need an upgrade to dash like you do in this game and all the other capsules as he said are hidden they're not just going to be straight on your way to the maverick like that one is that's why this is also a good first stage is because you automatically get that capsule so you can just zoom through the level much faster now these are right armors they appear in a few stages <coughs> dash around punch things um they have their own life which is it doesn't show up it's invisible but you won't take damage while you're in one i can hop out there we go all right stuff up there and back which i'll be revisiting stages later when we have more abilities to show you some stuff and those robots always made me laugh because they just throw snowballs and somehow snowballs can hurt you even though you're a super powerful robot. I don't know how that works out. Here we are, we're at our first Maverick. Well, this guy is super simple if you know what you're doing. Oh, he can, he'll slide around. He doesn't really have a set pattern. He'll make ice sculptures, which either then he'll slide into them or jump up at you. Jump up there and blow wind. He'll slide through them, break them. He might shoot some ice blocks at you. But he's not complicated. He is very easy. As I'm showing now. You can dash off walls and jump halfway across the screen. But that's it for him. They even take a hit from him. Awesome victory team. You get shotgun ice. Oh, demonstration. Alright guys, well, we are already done with our first Maverick, so I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Mega Man X. See you then.